whenever you purchase a new remote control for your TV or your VCR or your audio equipment, especially if you buy it at a flea market or as a second use remote control, you want to make sure that it is still working because the seller might promise you that it works, but what if it doesn't? Well, there's a very quick way to know if your remote control is still working. Just make sure your control has batteries on it and point your remote control towards your phone's camera, activate your camera and press any button on the remote control. If you press a button and you see a light, that is an infrared light from your remote control that is sending the, the, the indication for your TV to perform a certain action. If a button doesn't turn on when you press it, then it means that that button does not work. This works with any kind of remote control, no, doesn't matter the brand of the remote control. You might want to try every single button before purchasing your remote to make sure that every single button is working. For example, this remote, the power button is not working anymore. But the rest of them is, yep. This trick works with any kind of camera phone except these guys. The, the iPhones are really, really useless phones, so let me show you, but you cannot do this on, a, on an iPhone. Okay, you see the iPhone here, you see that I'm pressing here and I'm pointing at the remote control and the iPhone does not see anything anything you can see the remote is actually turning on every time I press it but the iPhone does not detect it at all and the same thing happens with any kind of remote the iPhone is just blind but if you use an Android phone as old as 2014, I mean, that's like uh, eight years old, it will detect it. Just look at this. You can see it's blinking both on the Android phone. And on the recording that I'm making. So this is another reason not to purchase an iPhone anymore. So now you know how to test your remote controls.